Hey there guys, today we're going to be painting the Lizardman Warrior from Reaper Miniatures to the tabletop level standard. First thing you want to do is grab yourself a scalpel or another sharp blade and just trim the casting line off of the model. Make sure you're very careful and you always cut away from yourself. I've base coated the entire model with bronze skin through my airbrush, but you can just as easily do this by hand if you like. Paint your shield and the scales at its waist with military green. You may need two thin coats at this stage, but this is normal. Use basic dirt to paint his base, his loincloth, club, belt, the sword at his waist and the quiver on his back. Use ghoul skin to paint his claws and the scales on top of his head and along his tail. Next, take brown sand and paint the handle of his sword and the spears in his quiver. Now use old bronze to paint his bracelets and the spikes on his club. Next we'll do some washes. Heavily dilute military green with water or flow improver and use this to wash over his skin and scales. When that's dry, dilute basic dirt and wash this over his shield to bring out the detail. Now we'll move on to the layers. Mix 50-50 bronze skin and bronzed highlight and use this to pick out his chest muscles and the details on his face.
Now mix half and half basic dirt and brown sand. Use this to layer up the brown areas on the model, leaving the darker base coat in the shadows and recesses, or where two areas meet to provide shading. Layer up his shield with a 50-50 mix of military green and ghoul skin. Finally, we'll add some quick highlights to make him really pop. Paint the edge of his scales with ghoul skin to make them stand out. Next, use tarnished brass to do the same to his jewellery and metal spikes, leaving the darker bronze in the shadows. And with that, the model is done. Now don't forget to like and subscribe, check out our other videos, and we will see you next time.